Okay, here's the situation. Car comes into your shop, either it has no oil pressure due to no oil in the crankcase. So what's happening to the bearings? Yes, they're getting damaged. But the variable valve timing system also needs oil pressure to operate properly. In other words, that oil pressure, well, it goes through a solenoid that's a spool valve that manages the position of the camshaft. Inside the actuator are chambers, and the actuator has two parts of this phaser. With this phaser, either it's in a lock position when there's no oil pressure forcing down on a pin, but when there's oil pressure, the pin is forced out and the actuator can move. So if you don't have any oil pressure, well, that camshaft is going to become a lock position or a fail-safe position and allow the engine to operate. But if that pin is sheared, well, it's gonna cause some noise issues, especially as the engine is first cranked over. When the pin is gone, well, you'll hear that rattle as it goes against the lifters and the camshaft lobes and it locks over and over inside the engine. The thing to remember here is the quality of the oil matters to the health of the actuator. If no one's changed oil, well, there's a good chance that, that pin could become snapped or other damage can occur to the veins. So when you're servicing a modern vehicle with variable valve timing, make sure you're looking at the quality of the oil, the quantity of the oil coming out of the pump, and also the pressure too. I'm Andrew Markell. Thank you very much.